In this video, we are going to see how to convert a URL link into a hyperlink text. So here, let's say that every time my user fills up a form to buy a product. So I'm going to send the payment link to that particular user. But before sending the link, I'm going to convert it into a hyperlink text and then send it to him via mail. How can that be done? So for this, I'm going to integrate these applications. And here I'm going to use an HTML code to turn the URL link into a hyperlink text. To integrate the two applications, I'm going to use Pabli Connect. Now to understand how you can do this yourself, integrate and automate this entire process, let's start. To begin with the process, we are first going to type the URL pabli.com slash connect. And as we do that, here we have reached the landing page. On the right hand side, we have two options, sign in and sign up for free. So since I'm an existing user, I'm going to click on sign in. And as I do that, here we have reached all applications page. These are the various products of Pabli. Here, I'm going to click on access now for Pabli Connect as we are doing this integration using Pabli Connect software. Now here you can see we have reached a dashboard. On the right hand side, we have a tab create workflow. Let's click on this and a dialog box has appeared, which is asking us to name this workflow. So what is my objective here? I want to convert a URL link into a hyperlink text. So I'm going to name it as convert a URL link into a hyperlink text. Let's click on create. And as we do that, here we have reached another window, which has got two extremely important events. One is trigger, another one is action. Now triggers and actions are basically those two principles or concepts on which this entire automation works. Trigger is when this happens, action says do this. Basically action here is the response of your trigger application. As per this integration, my trigger application here will be jot form. Let's click on this and the trigger event here will be new response. Now here you can see we have received a webhook URL. I'm going to copy this. And here we have been given the help desk. Please read this carefully. Let me show you what exactly we have to do. So I have already logged into my JotForm account. And here I have created a form which is spoken English course notes. You can create your own form by clicking on this orange tab. Now I'm going to click on edit form. As I do that here you can see this is the form with the following fields, first name, last name, email address, and phone number. Going to settings, here we have integrations. Now here we are going to look for webhooks. Let's click on this. And now this URL that we have just received, I'm going to copy this. And here I'm going to paste the same. Let's click on complete integration. And we can see that the integration is ready. Let's click on finish. So once this is done, here going to Pabli Connect, it is written that do a test submission so that the data can be recorded here in the webhook response. So now here I'm going to go to publish and open this link in a new tab. And now I'm going to fill up the information. So let's say here the first name is smart, the last name is user1, then the email address is smartuser1 at pablitudes.com. And here I'm going to enter the phone number. Now let's click on submit. So we can see that our form has been submitted. Going back to Pabli Connect, here we can see we have received the API response. So we can see that yes, here we have the user details, first name, last name, email address, and phone number. And now here is the form title. Once we have received this, I want to send the payment link of this particular course notes to the user via Gmail. So my action application here will be Gmail. Let's click on this and the action event here would be to send email. Let's click on connect. So here Pabli Connect is asking to connect itself with the Gmail account. I'm going to select add new connection and connect with Gmail. So here Pabli Connect is asking to choose the account. So done. And now here it is asking me to access my Google account. This is absolutely secure. So I'm going to click on allow. And as I do that, you can see that the authorization has been successful. So let's come down and here we have to enter the recipient's email address. So I'm going to map this information how. As I click on this, you can see the previous response. Now let's click on this and this here is the email address of the person. This method with which I have added the information here is known as mapping. And this is important so that every time the workflow runs, it can take the new data into consideration. Now, here is the sender's name. So I'm just going to write Pabli Connect. 
since this information is going to be static as it is not going to change so that's why i have written this manually then we have the email content type so i'm going to select html and then we have the email content so here i'm going to write here now i'm going to map the last name of the user here it is and then I'm going to write, you have successfully enrolled to our Pabli Connect Spoken English course. Please click on. Now this here is the HTML code to convert a URL into a hyperlink text. So here instead of this particular link, I am going to paste the link of the course, the payment link. For this, I'm going to take you to Stripe account. So here we have the Spoken English Notes link. The payment link is here. So I'm going to copy this and here I'm going to paste this. And then the hyperlink text has to be written here. So I'm going to write pay now. So our message becomes, please click on this particular link to make payment and acquire the spoken English notes regards Team Connect. Now, if you wish to add a file, so here we have to enter the file name and the attachment has to be here. Please understand that the file attachment size cannot exceed 25 MB. Now I'm going to click on save and send test request. So as I do that here, we have received the response according to which now a mail must be sent to the user. Let's go and check the same. So here we can see that yes, we have received the mail. Dear user one, you have successfully enrolled to our Public Connect Spoken English course and you can see that the entire link is turned into a hyperlink text. This means that our integration is a success. But we also need to check the same in real time. So I'm going to take you back to Jot form and here I'm going to again open the link in a new tab and let's fill up the form. So let's say these are the details. First name dummy, last name newt123. Then the email address is dummy new123 at pap Dudes.com. Now I'm going to enter the mobile number and let's click on submit. And here we can see that our form has been submitted. And now I'm going to directly take you to my Gmail account. Let's go to inbox and see if we have received the mail here. And yes, here you can see dear new one, two, three, and we have received the mail. So this means that our integration is a success. Going back to Pabli Connect, let's quickly understand what we have done. So this is an extremely easy two-step integration process where our trigger application is jot form, the event is new response, and then our action application is Gmail where the event is to send email. I hope this is absolutely clear to you. If in case you have any doubt, you can refer to the workflow which is given in the video description. You can also clone the same and start to process immediately. Apart from this, if you have any specific integration to work on, you can always write to us. Not only this, but you can integrate multiple applications using Pabli Connect software. To ask any of your query, you have to write at forum.pabli.com. You can also visit our website, which is www.pabli.com connect. To get all the details about the latest updates, the integrations and applications, you can visit our Facebook group. If in case you have found this video helpful, then do not forget to share this with your friends and colleagues so that they can also get into automation and make their life easy. I'm going to see you very soon with different integrations and automations. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Take care of yourself.